open source technology having been around for quite a while, a thriving global community has grown around it. So code is shared amongst developers and everyone can test, rebuild and learn from each other. As the industry has begun adopting open source technologies in almost every vertical, many current technologies have used open source as their very foundation. Hi all, I welcome you to this Edureka session and today we are going to talk about the list of top 10 groundbreaking open source technologies for the year 2021. Now this list does not claim to be an absolute list, so feel free to leave your suggestions in the comment section below. Also kindly take up this time to subscribe to us and don't forget to hit that bell icon to never miss an update from the Edureka YouTube channel. Also to learn about more trending technologies, do check out our training page, the link to which is given in this description box below. So without much ado, let's get started. So first of all, we have blockchains. Now the blockchain technology is rapidly undergoing intense development due to great interest from academia and industry factor. Now what makes this special is that blockchain is almost like an incorruptible digital ledger of economic transactions that can be programmed to record not just financial transaction but virtually everything else of value. Now there are different blockchain open source platforms namely ERIS or ERIS, you have Hydra Chain, Multi Chain, Open Chain, Ethereum Project and Hyperledger. These are few of the popular ones. As of recent, blockchain finds its use in real estate, banking, digital voting, copyright and royalty production, data sharing to monitor supply chains, payment processing and money transfers, and heavy investment from companies such as IBM, Waltz, Coinbase, Gemini, so on and so forth. With that, let's move on to our next technology. Let's talk about containers. Now container in a software development lifecycle is a standard unit of software that packages all of your code and all its dependencies so that the application runs quickly and reliably from one computing environment to another. This breaks the age old argument of this app runs on my system but does not run in yours and quickens the deployment process of your software applications iterations. A few open source containerization apps are obviously Docker, you have AWS Fargate, Google Kubernetes Engine, Amazon ECS, Container Linux by CoreOS and many more. Companies such as Google, AWS, Microsoft and RHEL are heavily invested in this technology. Moving on next, we have open source virtual reality, augmented reality and mixed reality. So the recent years have seen an increased interest in the implementation and usage of virtual reality, augmented reality and even mixed reality, particularly in areas of healthcare applications, military construction, media, films, entertainment and engineering. However, a higher adoption is limited due to high costs of developing such a software, the lack of technical skills and difficulties in the implementation environment as well. Now to overcome these hurdles, open source has come to the rescue. Now open source has deep roots in this domain and will grow deeper and more advanced in the coming years in terms of live implementations, SDKs and software. With the implementation of open source, new reality called XR or extended reality has evolved which is pretty advanced and has many live implementations. There are various toolkits, platforms, SDKs for VR, AR and MR, namely open source virtual reality for gaming, the AR toolkit, the Apertus VR, Open Space 3D, Holokit, MixR, High Fidelity, Open Mask, so on and so forth. And various companies like Facebook, Google, Magic Leap, HTC, Samsung have started adopting open source based technologies for bringing out hardware and software for common masses to consume. Moving on in our list, we have cyber security. When creating a security policy for any organization or when building a security operation or a research center, the prime requirement is to have the right people, processes and effective tools. And such can be said for cyber security as well. I would have spoken about domains, but to be honest, not many domains can function without cyber security. It can be your healthcare, finance, banking, IT, publishing, so on and so forth. 
Now the market is filled with lots of security tools and even Linux distributions like Kali Linux, the Pad Security Toolset, Network Security Toolkit, Cyborg Hawk, and many more. All of these used by security and penetration testing professionals for real-time security operations and to find vulnerabilities and backdoors in existing networks. While no company today exists without a cybersecurity cell, a few prominent companies in the domain are Black Duck Software, RHEL, FireEye, and Logarithm. Next on our list, we have Progressive Web Apps, or PWAs, which brings a mobile app-like experience to end users without any app installation requirements. A few tools for building PWAs are React, Polymer Template, Webpack, Lighthouse, along with JavaScript, CSS, and HTML. And they have a level of performance and usability that's nearly identical to native apps. They can work with most browsers and devices, fit in all screens with responsive designs, enable offline connectivity, and offer an app-like experience with features like push notifications and web app manifest. There are some very big names doing progressive web apps right, including but not limited to Forbes, Flipkart, and The Washington Post. Next on our list, we have Internet of Things, which is a highly fragmented technology that is changing continuously. Now, open source plays a crucial role in creating IoT platforms, as well as ready-made prototypes in terms of development boards for R&D and automation. Now, IoT standards, together with artificial intelligence, are controlling and interpreting a wide range of activities in a small manner. With the use of open source technologies, there is no web. IoT requires the same level of ubiquitous common access in its core functionalities and to the web for shared accessibility. And a few of the open source IoT platforms include KAIoT, ThingSpeak, DeviceHive, Finger.io, and open source IoT hardware such as development boards like Arduino, Freeduino, Raspberry Pi, BBC Microbit, Orange Pi, as well as operating systems like Raspbian, Kodi, etc and companies such as Cisco, IBM, Google, Microsoft, and AT&T are some of the leading companies using these technologies. Next on our list, we actually have a programming language called Python. Now, as most of us know, Python is a high-level general purpose programming language, which is developed under an OSI-approved open source license, making it freely usable and distributable, even for commercial use. Now, it had initially found its way into the market as a scripting and automation aiding language, but sooner than later, it found its way into many bleeding edge technology domains such as web development, machine learning, artificial intelligence, deep learning, data science, etc. It provides diverse statistical functionalities and libraries, is highly dynamic, scalable, and extensible as a language that provides advanced features used for all of the applications that I had mentioned previously. It currently has more than 200,000 packages, and this is just counting those hosted on PyPy, which is the official Python package index. All of these are available through PyPy, Omega Hat, GitHub, and other repositories. And companies such as Google, Facebook, and Spotify, Netflix, and Dropbox are some leading names associated with Python today. Next on our list, we have Big Data Analytics. Now, IDC says that worldwide revenues for big data and business analytics will be more than 203 billion US dollars by the end of this year, with an annual growth rate of 12%. Nowadays, most organizations understand the value of capturing all the data streaming inside the business and hence employ open source big data analytics to gain crucial advantage from it. Big data finds its applications in many different domains such as retail, healthcare, education, e-commerce, media and entertainment, finance and telecom. And some popular big data analytics tools and platforms are Apache Hadoop, which is the most popular, Gridgain, Cassandra, TerraStone, Solar, Uzi and Zookeeper. And companies such as IBM, Salesforce, Cloudera, Crunchbase, Google and Oracle are all companies investing in these open source technologies to take advantage of this beautiful technology called Big Data. Next on our list, we have Cloud Computing. Now, Cloud Computing is one of the most significant technologies to have emerged in the last couple of years and perhaps in the next decade even. 
Innovations in cloud have led to remarkable trends like increasing adoption of public cloud, the container technologies like Docker, Kubernetes, Apache, Mesos, etc., and the adoption of DevOps in application delivery and open source tooling by companies. It has also led to the creation of path-breaking technologies such as Cognitive Cloud, Anything as a Service, and Distributed and Omni Cloud as well. Some common open source cloud applications include OpenStack, CloudStack, Eucalyptus, OpenQRM, and OpenShift. Other open source cloud computing simulators include CloudSim, Cloud Analyst, Icon Cloud, Green Cloud, and CloudSCED. And companies such as Google, AWS, Microsoft, and CloudEra are taking advantage of these cloud computing advancements on the daily. Finally, at the end of our list, we have machine learning. Now, machine learning is a study of algorithms that use large data sets to learn, generalize, and predict. Now, the most exciting aspect of ML is that with more data, the algorithms improve its predicting power. Now, this has acted as a strong base for self-driving cars, speech recognition, home automation products, and so much more. It's closely also related to computational statistics and focuses on making predictions which help with finance, healthcare, law and order or the crime department, etc. It is regarded as an effective method for deploying complex models and algorithms that lend themselves to prediction in the commercial space. Now, the most recent ML engines that have been open sourced by various IT giants are Google Cloud Machine Learning Engine, Amazon's Machine Learning Engine for AWS, Unity Machine Learning Agents, Apache Prediction IO, Microsoft's Distributed Machine Learning Toolkit, etc. And companies that invest in machine learning include big names but are not limited to NVIDIA Corp, Alphabet, Salesforce, Amazon, Microsoft, IBM, and many, many more. With that, I come to the end of my list. Now, if you are interested in any of these technologies, do not forget to check out our training page on www.edureka.co to learn about all of these current and trending technologies and upskill yourself in the coming year. Also, do not forget to leave in the comment section below your suggestions for our list of top 10 open source technologies for 2021. With that, I close this session. My name is Upasna. Thank you and have a great day. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning!